Okay, so welcome back. I'm going to go ahead and start um, just my daily chores really quickly. I'm not going to spend a ton of time straightening up, but I do need to get my dishes unloaded, need to make my bed, I need to start some laundry, and just kind of pick up some clutter. But I do want to complain to my family, and let me show you guys what I do. So in my past vlogs about decluttering, I'm trying to get my family on the right track where they're doing what I do. When you come in through the door, you put your shoes in one place. It's a, like the one touch method. If you have a jacket, you put it in the right place. Everything has a place where it goes. Um, you know, same thing with dishes. If they finish their dishes, they need to load them in, this, in the dishwasher if the dishwasher is empty, just things like that. But this is my complaint and I wanna show you guys what I do when it happens. So this is the entryway through our back door, which is where our, our family comes in. And as you can see, I had that all cleaned up last week, but people have placed things there. So that's now a mess. And then if you look here, everyone takes their shoes off here. Um, they always just take their shoes off, they leave them here. They'll sit here for days if I don't complain to them. And the thing that kills me is we have these drawers that our shoes go in. All they have to do is take them off and put them in there or take them down to their bedrooms. But they do not do that and it drives me nuts. So let me tell you what I do real quick. What I will do is I will Snapchat that to my kids and I will say, hey, did you forget to put something away? Why is this still sitting here? It drives them nuts, but that's what I'm starting to do. I'm just starting to bug them a little bit. But now I go through the dilemma, do I let it sit there or do I go ahead and put it away? But I'm trying to get things picked up, so that is what I'm doing. And one other really quick tip that I've been doing that helps a lot is I take a laundry basket along to every room that I'm straightening up. If there's things like this, shoes, whatever, that are just laying around that are driving me crazy that don't belong here, I just throw them in a laundry basket and then I make people go through it later or I'll take them down to their bedrooms and just set them all on their bed and make them put them away later. Just so they don't sit here and cause the clutter that's gonna cause me to go mad. <laughs> so, all right guys, that's just what I'm doing. I'm gonna hurry and clean up the house real quick. Not spending a whole lot of time on it because I do wanna start the decluttering project with my cupboards. Again, I'm going to go ahead and tackle that bottom shelf right there and those two top shelves. So let me show you what I'm working with. There's that bottom shelf. <laughs> and then the top two I'll do. All right, guys. So I removed everything from three shelves. <laughs> this is all of the mess. Ah, it's crazy. My whole countertop is full. One question I have to myself, I've got brown sugar. What the hell guys? What, like why, why did I have this? And not only do I have this, I have two more bags and they're all hard. What am I doing? <laughs> anyway, so now everything is cleaned off. The shelves are clean. This top shelf I did leave my crock pot and my KitchenAid mixer. That is actually my mom's. I mean, I think that this thing is probably 40 years old or more, so, but it still works. All right, I'm going to get going. I'll show you the results at the end. Okay, so I am done. Um, you guys, I threw away a lot of expired food, but here is the bottom shelf. Here's the one I did yesterday. I'd really like to get some pasta holders. There's our cereal drawer. Here's the one I did yesterday. Look how empty that is, and look how empty that is. I've got um, all this protein stuff, and this is all my son, so I'm gonna try to find a different place for that. But I would also maybe get some containers to put like sugar and flour in, so it's just not in these. I hate it when the sugar falls out and gets all over your cabinets, so. Yeah. 